Uh, it's been a week. I've ordered the parts, but all I got was the head gasket so far and exhaust gaskets. I cleaned everything up, tested the thermostat, thermostat works good. Cleaned all the surfaces on this. Exhaust gasket, RC intake. It's a timing chain, ordered that, that didn't come yet. But the uh, racer's out here, He's, he cleaned everything out up here. He's starting to assemble it. He cleaned all the surfaces on there. There he is. How much are you going to be able to get done? Just the heads? Heads, push rods. Oh, yeah, okay. So, yeah, that's. Uh, oh, yeah, look. I didn't realize it. You already got the lifters in there. On the one side, anyway. Yeah. It's a lot nice and easy now. Before they barely want to come out. Yeah. I cleaned all those lifters and rocker arms and stuff that are over there. I think I'm fogging up, Racer. It's so hot out here. Right. I just took this from a cold uh, air conditioned garage. And it's like 90, 96 out here, I think, today. So I'm going to shut this off to my uh, camera acclimates. Got a buddy Mike here. He's painting up the, the cylinder heads with that uh, Indian head shellac. Mm -hmm. Let's go out here and check Racer, see how far Racer's going. How's it looking, buddy? Shellacking it. Racer shellacked up this side here. How's it look? He's shellacking the piston. The piston will never move now. It's pretty good. What's that thing up top there? What do you call that? The uh, plastic valve? shit. Yeah. Uh, the valve. This plastic. Yeah. Piece? That's just uh, your valve guy. Or you're not your valve guy. Your, uh, your lifter guy. Huh. I've never seen anything like that before in my life. Plastic, but they didn't have plastic when I was growing up. It was metal. All right. All right. I bought these uh, marine gaskets, Victor uh, Rhines or whatever, Rhines, Rhines, Runes. But anyway, I'm not sure if that's why the original ones failed because some people put car gaskets on it. But I don't know if you can see this, but this one, this one actually says Marine on it. So if it fails, it's not because it's a car one. Each one of these, each one of these head gaskets cost more than a whole set for a car. The complete, the complete gasket set. Okay, here we go. Head's going on. Oh, hang on a minute. Did you mark them left and right? All right, where were we? Had the wrong head on. We didn't, we didn't mark them, but we knew which one was which. We just uh, didn't pay any attention. Because one of them was actually rusty worse than the other. So they went on pretty good. Oh, he's got the manual here. I don't know if you can see that. There we go. The sequence and the torque specs. And he got this big monster torque wrench here, digital. Mm -hmm. Quite impressive, Mike. Thank you. Never know. Never had one of them when I was a kid. Yeah. Matter of fact, first one I had was one deals with the needle. Oh yeah, that's what I, that's what my 3 8 drive is, a beam torque wrench. Yep. Alright, let's do this. Alright. Take the man. Let's light up on it. No, it's a clutch type. Still you'll, you'll feel it quick. There, you there go. we go. Wow, that didn't take much. That's, nope. Well, that's, a, that's your first sequence. Oh, right. You're going to do this one? three times. Oh man. Number two is the third one in down here. Yep. Hmm. Number three is one, one more forward. Hmm. Number four is that one. This is working good. I'll just tell you which one is. Uh, number five is this one. Okay. It's going to take a while. They're going to have to do this Six. three times. Tighten them, tighten them more each time. So uh, I'll let these guys do that and we'll show you when they're done. Eight. All right. They torqued them all down in sequence to 30 pounds. Now racers got to go 65 on each one of these. This one. Yep. <laughs> he says he's afraid he's going to snap. It's a lot. There we go. Scared of 65. Oh. I, I, I'm always, I know. Uh, Alright, all these guys keep going. 
All right, while they're putting out the head on and torquing it down, I uh, put some thread sealing on these all these bolts here. I think technically you're supposed to replace all the bolts, but uh, there's a low buck operation here, so we're going to reuse the same ones. They're all right. All right. You go, racer's putting these uh, the other head on here. What the hell is that thing, racer? I don't know. You gave it to me. Somebody Spe use it. A speed a speed wrench. <laughs> you're going too slow. I want this thing done before uh, summer's over. I feel like I'm in a NASCAR pit stop. Here we go. Mike's over there. Mike uh, put the rockers on, the push rods in. Mm -hmm. Wow. Too bad we don't have all the parts. We could have had this out on the water tonight. Yeah. All right. I'll let him put these back in, then they got to torque them. I'm not going to show you that because you already seen how to torque them. All right. Uh, there's not much more uh, racer can do with this until I get the, the rest of the gasket set. So he's just playing around and putting the, the garnish on, you know, the, the pump here, power steering pump, and all the other stuff. But until we get the other gasket, we can't put the timing chain on or the valve covers or the, the intake, any of that. So I guess uh, this should just probably be a short video until we get that stuff. All right. Oh, look who stopped by. Hey. Hey. Alright. 